Stop running, stop running, stop running, stop running, stop running. Stop running backwards. Race track. Yeah. All right, that's where we want to go. Yeah. Horse, 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 horse. Don't run into the tree again. <laughs> I want to get that thing. I think that's a gem down there. Come on. Come on, Barbie. We need to get rich. We need to get rich, and the only way is to collect magical forest gems. No. No, no. What? Horse, 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 horse. I'm pretty sure there's no this horse. I should probably name this horse something other than horse. Although I do quite like the name horse because I can go and talk to people and be like, "Hey, Barbie, you're looking good," and you'll be like, "Actually, I'm feeling a little horse," and that's because you're on a horse and it's hilarious, and everyone will laugh, and uh, the world would be a better place. We got one gem. We got one gem. We're gonna... Ha who are we going to get? Jake, I think. We're going to Jake. We're gonna get this apple first, though. Detour. So one thing about motion controls what is that they never work cottage. for me. What a sweet little cottage. Let's ignore it entirely and grab apples. Come on. We already got three out of ten apples. Look at this. Look at what we're doing right here. Let's visit the cottage. Maybe there's uh, a mystical gypsy waiting for us in this cottage. Hello, Barbie. Hello, Barbie. <laughs> I cannot control this creature. I just want to talk to this Whoa, cottage lady. Barbie. Stop. There, there, no. Are we not gonna? Whoa. Not gonna. Whoa. We cannot actually talk to this person. Well, hello, Barbie. Goodbye, Barbie. We're just gonna continue in this direction. Because there are gems afoot. You think that the people that live here know about these gems just lying around? But, you know. Some people, they're, they're, they're okay with gems on their landscape. Makes it a bit more interesting. Makes it so that when you're walking and tra traloping through the fields, that you're like, hey, that's cool. I found myself a gem. What is the this green track. star? I can't wait to ride on it. Oh, the racetrack. That is a lamp. But maybe that's Jake. Jake, 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 hey, Jake. Hey there, Barbie. Good to meet you. I hear you're quite a rider. I'd like to work with you, but we've had some trouble with the storm. I don't... But what? There's like one twig in the way. You guys should just pick up some twigs. Wow, that storm really messed up our racetrack. No, it didn't. Before anyone can go riding, we need to clear the debris from the tracks. Have you ever seen you a storm? the children's course and let me know when you think it's safe for the kids to start their riding lessons again? The kids can be... They'll, they'll be fine. The kids are just like, oh, we'll just jump over it with our horse. Don't they teach children how to jump over things with yes, the horses anymore? So much trash on the track. <sighs> yeah. Why would there be so much trash? If only there was someone around here that told us exactly why that was the case, Barbie. God, the codex sounds sounds hey weird. You. It's really great that you can groom and feed your horse at the stables, the racetrack, and the old riding house. Don't you think? Thanks. Yeah. My answer to that is yeah. But sure, we're just gonna keep picking up sticks. Why, is... so much trash on the track? Why do you... You've already asked this question. Hiya. Hi. No, no. <laughs> oh, God. This is what it would be like if I actually rode a horse. I would yeah, actually die. I would run into a horse with my horse. And I would fall off. Break my shins. Great job. The track looks practically new. <laughs> now the kids and the horses can get some exercise. I hear you're a pretty good rider from Jenna. I can't wait to see your time. The track looks like new. We picked up five sticks. <sighs> okay, you're gonna mark out the course for your race with flags. I'm not gonna do Place that. Place the flags in position to create the course, and then come back to me and we'll start. Do I have any... Of course I don't have any options in this. We're gonna place the flags yeah! in exactly the same places where we were previously. Okay. That flag's in place. I have to place two flags. You know, now the track is starting to look as good as noon. Previously, it just looked like someone removed five sticks. And I cannot... I, I try, but it's not letting me. Come on. It... Okay, what, what do you want from me again? Do I really need to be that much closer? Do I really need to be that much closer to the glowy glows? I want to be closer to the glowy glows. Hey, Barbie. Oh god. I love how every okay, person's like that flags in place. It's like every person in this world okay, that flags in place. doesn't have any resemblance of like object permanency and the moment 
they lose eyesight of me. It's like, well, this person stopped okay. existing. That flag's in place. And then I come back and it's like, oh my god. She's back. I thought you were gone forever, but in fact, you just were 12 feet away from me. It's, you know, I, strict, I sometimes forget. I just want to stop my voice. I didn't mean to jump over that man. Jake! Hey, Barbie. Jake! Excellent. That looks like a good course. Wow, really? Ready to race it? Man, it's like I placed all the flags in the exactly specified locations. That's a solid course. Yes. Take a turn around it. Let's see how you do. That is actually what you said previously. Let's take a turn around and see how well I can go around this course for like the fifth time now. Oh, can we do it? I don't think we've proven ourselves so far. Yeah. yeah! Let's go around this course. I like how there's only music when we're doing these races, and these races take like three seconds. Like, we have 20 seconds to reach the next heart, and the next heart is like there. This is the worst course I've ever been on. How many laps are we getting? We're just going in a circle. This is like really cheap NASCAR on a horse. In fact, if I had a car, this game would be a lot more interesting. <laughs> Although, if I had a car that could jump like a horse, that would actually be really cool. Maybe they should have made this Barbie's jumping car adventures. That was the worst course I've ever seen. I am offended and appalled about everything here. Kyle, Jake. Way to go! Good race! I think you might almost be ready for a ribbon challenge. But take your time. I'm ready for the ribbon challenge. I feel ready for the ribbon challenge, but Kyle is just not letting me. Kyle is not letting me prove that I am ready to win that second ribbon. And that bothers me, because I feel like I've trained hard for this. I ran all the way here. And, well, that's really all I did. But still, I ran all the way here. This is quite a distance. This is quite a trek we have to make to get to these places. Look at how fast my horse can go. There is a water bucket symbol in my top left corner. Maybe that means Barbie's thirsty. Maybe it means my horse is thirsty. The thing is no longer yellow and it became white. What is... Maybe I should give my horse a drink drink. Maybe I should give it some seawater. There's plenty of it. I heard everyone loves drinking seawater. Swimming. Well, it's not wrong. I guess. It's more walking through water. I wouldn't really call this a swim, really. More just a... A brisk walk. But I guess brisk walking wouldn't really be an exciting description of anything. Yeah. I am facing a problem here. I just wanna... I just wanna go to the star. I just wanna... I just wanna go. I just wanna go. No more worries. We're just gonna... Take the detour route. I can see the star nearby. But I can also see a star over there. Right. Where do I wanna go? Right away. Um... Yes. I'll You're get you groomed right away. Miss, miss, can you help me? Oh, no. My name is Jonathan Hollis. Oh, I Jonathan. The storm took away my favorite model ship and blew it up to sea. Oh, no. My dad gave it to me. Oh, please find it for me. You do not sound like your voice doesn't really match your body, but... Oh, no, Jonathan. I'll find your model ship for you. I wonder where it could be. I wonder if you couldn't have just walked. You better scrape your hooks, pal. It's time. Why are you so needy? But I wonder where the horse could be. I wonder if it's anywhere near that star over there. Could it be? Could, could it be that the orange blip? I feel like he could have walked this. I feel like he could have done this himself. Here it is. Hardly the worst for wear. We Jonathan will be so happy. We found a lost ship in our adventure. Thank you world what is this we found oh what's this a banana a bottle oh it looks like there's a note inside wow to whoever finds this it looks like our boat is going down no no and i will never see my beautiful island again no no i was so scared to go on the boat and now i know why no no you're getting the lifeboats ready but i'm still scared oh. so if anyone finds this you can have the jewelry I hid. What? I hid it in the old place and gave the key to my heart to my best friend. Mama's calling now. That's... Think of me. Signed, Hannah Roberts. Hannah. Hmm. Roberts? Maybe 
she's related to Mrs. Roberts, the stable owner. I should check in with her. That's not good. I wonder how long yeah. this thing was here now. Maybe, maybe, maybe she's already safely returned at this point. I mean, it turns out that, like, notes in a bottle. It takes a while for them to reach the proper destination, and the fact that it even ended up on the right island is somewhat of a, somewhat of a miracle on its own. But sure, let's uh, let's bring it back to Mrs. Uh, Roberts or whatever her name was. But first, we're gonna go bring back a lost ship. And surely, Jonathan will be so pleased to see his lost ship back in his possession again. It was too, too far away to walk. Too far away to walk. Such a problem. My boat! My boat! Oh, thank you so much! You're welcome! Oh man, that's a happy Jonathan. Jonathan's never been so pleased. Awesome. Let's go to the next star. We'll bring back that note later. You know, the possible last Hi. message of a missing relative might not be as important as a woman standing next to a bunch of, a bunch of outhouses. Hey, Barbie, where have you been? <laughs> Are you enjoying camp? Yeah. I was thinking that maybe we could help decorate the hall for the graduation day ceremony. Yeah. I know we could come up with something really cool. How when about... In, I noticed some really pretty seashells on the <sighs> beach. Maybe we could start there. Take whatever you find to Mrs. Roberts, and I'll do the same. Now, the irritating thing is, I saw those seashells at the seashore and at first I thought hey she sells seashells yeah, at the seashore yeah. but no I can't pick up those seashells but now Teresa's like hey maybe you should pick hello. up those seashells hello. well maybe I should hello old sailor man uh, we miss <coughs> I tell you we be needing a bit of help here yes. every cabin along this beach has a buoy that Boy. uses the cabin cabin but that darn storm took all those buoys and mixed them up and down the shoreline no <sighs> If you find any of them, mm -hmm. put them back where they belong. I will find them and put them back where they belong. Oh, where, oh, where could they possibly be? They are so well hidden and do not have uh, for the a big old yellow glowy symbol flying the above the them at all. They are practically invisible to my naked eye. But let's put them back at their okay. rightful place. place. All right. Now it appears that there is some sort of orange thing on the radar here. Oh, it's another boy. Who did thunk it? Now we are truly ready to put the buoys back in their original position. The captain will be so pleased. Whoa. Stop. Boy. Boy. Okay, that's in place. Yes, it is. Final buoy. Put it in place. Whoa. Be hey, that's in place. a life savior. I am just wiggling my Wiimote oh, like a crazy man at this point. No! Oh, that's a great job. No. All the boys are back in place, and everything looks real ship shape. Ship shape. <laughs> well, if only my own boat could be in that good a shape. <laughs> if only your boat was that good. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'm afraid it's seen better days. I just want to start it up to get to the mainland. No. But I need a long rope, a screwdriver, and some gasoline. <laughs> Without that, this boat's staying beached. Uh, if only those objects were relatively nearby and easy to find. Or anyone with a GPS. If only. Oh, hey, what's this? Oh, here's a screwdriver for Bob. Wow, it's a screwdriver. Who'd have yeah. thunk it? It's right there all along. What a lovely seashell. What a lovely seashell. Nothing says originality like decorating an island, and the only decoration you can use is seashell. seashells. Truly. That's never been done before. What a lovely seashell. What a lovely seashell. I have to say, this one's lovely too. What a lovely seashell. I'm glad Barbie agrees with me. Every other seashell. What a lovely seashell. Don't you think this is a lovely seashell? Ugh. We found the seashells by the seashore. And now we shall sell the seashells. 
Not at the seashore. In fact, that seems like a questionable business decision. And we will not ride with such questionable yeah. ethics. Now, where or where could we possibly find a long rope and some gasoline? If only there was something, some machine, which would show us exactly the location of all of these aforementioned items. You know, if only. That would be swell. Move. I wish to go not left, right. I wish to go to Jonathan. Remember Happy Jonathan? Hi, Barbie. Hi, Jonathan! <laughs> All right, let's get off of this horse. This is not going to happen. Dismount. Leave. Stop turning. Dismount. There you go. All right, Barbie. This is what you've been trained to do. <laughs> Walking is so hard in this game. <laughs> this cord ought to do the trick. Oh, yeah, this cord. Hmm. Like, you have no idea. In, in like, the PlayStation 2 version, you just do everything with analog sticks. And doing everything yeah. with motion controls and weird D-pad pushes is hard. <laughs> I'm not ready for this. I was not prepared for these difficult shenanigans. But here we are. Proud and ready. Dick on the world. Yeah. Would be a shame if suddenly gasoline would pour all over us. That would be a problem. And a half. But fortunately, we managed to take it to the capsule. <laughs> what a darling you are. Yeah. Now I can get the lucky lady back out on the water. Mm. The lucky lady. Well, if that's not a good name for a ship. Yes, Captain. Hi, Barbie. It's hey, Jenna. Jenna. Just wanted to let you know that Jake checked in with me and said he thinks you're ready for your second ribbon. Ah, yeah. See him at the track. Go see him at the racetrack. More like, yeah. let's see what this golden star is over here because that seems more important to me. Good bit, Teresa. What? Barbie, it's late and time for the campers to get back to the stables. I'm coming to pick you up. No, no. What? Why? Huh, I was... What a beautiful new morning. Ah, I was just gonna. Ah. Yeah. I was so almost ready to do that, but then I wasn't. Hello again. Right, seashells by the seashore. Oh, these are so pretty. Where did They'll I find them? You wonder. The decorations. Thanks. Thanks. Oh my! That must have been my great aunt Hannah. You know, she survived actually. She must have been just about your age when she left the island and moved to Europe with her parents. Of course. As I remember the tale, she was very scared to go. And so she left behind a lot of her things. Hmm. The ship hit gale force winds no. and was very close to sinking. Whoa. But the boat came through and Hannah lived in Europe the rest of her life. Oh, thank goodness. How amazing to find this now after all these years. I don't know hmm. why that... I think I have some more of Hannah's things here. Why don't you come back later and see if I found anything? Okay. I like your spirit, I don't Barbie. no. Try stop. Your... Stop talking to yeah. me. Y all right. You. You're the one that just pulled me out of my reality and put me back here again at a hey, later time I... of day. Oh my god. That's so much. This is all What's mucking out the stables? You know, I have really appreciated all your help. Thanks. Now Jenna's got me fixing the fence out by the road. And I still haven't mucked out the stables yet. Oh, today. no. Would you mind doing it? The shovel is sitting over beside the stable door. Just get it and clean out the boxes of each of the horses that are in the stables. Yeah. I'd rather do everything else I could possibly do, but... And go from stall to stall to muck out the boxes. Yeah. The horses need to have a clean home. How about we first take care of our own horse before we start messing around with the other horses? That looks good. Cause We're it's about time we clean up our horse, make it look beautiful. Make it look so happy. Oh, um Does a horse not need anything else anymore? Or does it only show up what it needs when you're on it? Oh, it only shows up when you're Alright. Horse to the next station. And stop! You must get off the horse to perform that action. Obviously, it is impossible to do this particular okay, move. The hooks are all good now. 
You've only done one. You've continuously been doing the same hoof every single time. It's never gonna be fully clean if you don't dedicate yourself to the art, Barbie. Ah. There you are. Nice clean water. Wow, wow. We feed our horse just to be safe. Om nom nom. Om nom nom. That should keep you out of the hayfields for a while. The hayfields. He didn't even eat anything. He just put his nose in it. He might be sick. He's not eating at all. Hi, Kyle. 